every day in the newspapers we see that so many jobs will be there so many jobs have been created and many people come to us with their interview letters very nice we are happy because this government every time the elections come close they regularize mining they give jobs but soon after election they forget one thing i will tell the chief minister and also minister for health minister for power all these ministers are on to remind there are hundreds of goons and youth who are working in various departments some of them over 5 years some of them 3 years they are as work charges or contract basis i would request the government you people are elected by the public please make sure that all these who have been working for 5 years and above should be regularized even though you have to call them and have interview but see that they are regularized and don't take new people and keep them aside after working for 5 years i have been also chief minister and i was there i regularized all those who have worked for 5 years and above so i hope you will not take them for a ride by calling them giving them false promises by calling them for interview and regularize somebody else second thing so we had floods and these are unfortunate especially in uzgaon because of the water from the dam so it was totally inundated many poor people maybe they may be mud houses their houses collapse up to now many of them have not given been given money to rebuild the houses or part of the houses especially in nanus the other day i read in the paper i want to tell the chief minister and others you are not doing a favor government of india gave you 300 crores please utilize it for this purpose for the benefit and well being of goans same thing sugar factory they are workers they are on strike people were promised money they were not given i don't know why they give false promises please make sure there are few days left for ganesh make sure that they are given whatever you all have promised before ganesh don't make them run from one side to the other from pillar to post to get their amount please give them as early as possible if possible give them before ganesh festival and also other subsidies in unorganized sectors they all have distributed the forms people are happy they are going to get 5000 5000 then they come to us when the government is sleeping they evict and they abandon them the mp saying that please sir put a word so that you get please give them as early as possible so that they can utilize their money for increasing or continuing their business the third thing next thing is i have been time and again i have been saying regarding two things one is our mining they said mining is going to start tomorrow the after tomorrow the after now today i read again the about supreme court saying this that well, supreme court is not wrong, wrong but see that you do it as early as possible because thousands of families who are depending on mining today they go hungry don't give false promises follow the supreme court orders <clears throat> see what way you can relax 
within the rules and do it as early as possible. Last time I had said about sand. Again, I want to remind them. Please earmark places for sand extraction. This they have been doing before, it's not a new. Because can you build any construction without sand? I don't say I'm not encouraging illegal sand extraction. But because they are doing, at least sand is available. Otherwise sand would have been like gold in Goa. Please, I want to tell the government, open your eyes. Here are my places for sand extraction. And side by side, import sand. We just stop it. How construction will come up? Please do this so that all these corrupt officers, some of the corrupt police who make money on this, that will be stopped. And sand will be available at a much lower price. So the last thing I would to bring to the notice of the government. I don't know what is wrong with BJP at the center and also here. Yesterday our youth, they were lati charged and most of the police were without their names except the device fee. I want to ask them what is this democracy? See the price of gas cylinder, see the price of petrol. And based on the price of petrol, everything, all other things, they revolve around the price of petrol. Commodities go up, everything goes up, and this government has closed the eyes. I remember when Congress government was there, if one rupee was increased, they would come on the roads. Today the prices have nearly touched 100, in some places is beyond. Gas cylinders has come to 800 and odd. The other day they increased 25 rupees. I don't know why the government is blind and deaf to the feelings of the people. Please open your eyes. Elections will come. That time will the, the Congress party will show them. But that is secondary. Then there is time for election. Till then, don't provoke people. Till then, don't make people suffer. Because if whether you are elected or you are the borrowed government from Congress, it is your duty to look after the people of the state. Thank you. Any questions? Yeah. And the last thing is, the after tomorrow is the Ganesh Festival. I, in my own name, as a South Goa MP, I wish South Goa Muslim Hindus for a happy Ganesh festival. And side by side, people from all over Goa, I wish you all happy Ganesh, and I hope Lord Ganesh will open the eyes of this government so that they stop all these irregularities. Thank you. Akhidyanla is acknowledged. To get question number of comic movies. No, I don't take some political. Some. See, in the recent past, you have been vociferous in demanding a change in leadership, saying the party is on a decline in the last five years, so many elections. Party High Command has maintained the status quo. What are you going to do? Has this a party state still go up now? Or how do you visualize this? this See, look here. If party had to follow what I said, party would have gone very high. Now, as a member of parliament, belonging to this party. Even if the decision is not to my liking, 
is my duty to see that Congress comes out. I cannot work miracles, but I can work for the betterment of the party in South Goa at least, if not the whole Goa. Workers of Congress party will lead this assembly election. So what is your reaction? Why only this time, every time, either MLA or MP, we all depend on, on the workers of Congress. And the other guys who lead, I have been AB leaders. If tomorrow even God contests and he has got no workers, then he'll have to sit inside and make others pray for him. That's all. No, he said that workers will be a deciding maker about the election in Goa. Yes, every time. In the beginning, finally, like we have our opinion, finally the high command will decide. In the beginning, workers decide. Then it comes to the high command and then they take a decision. This is how party functions. strives to bring members of all sections together. Our, our aim, primary aim at the moment is to get back whatever forces that have been, that have, we have pushed away or have left us due to certain reasons. So we will strive to bring back all sections of society. It will be our endeavor to ensure that no section feels alienated. And come back together as one. Why is this opinion as the rise in the gap to the Congress party? Has the leadership failed in the last four years to build a party? No, I don't, I, I don't, I don't, I don't agree that. that we not then why is there a need to get people from I, I will tell you. We have identified or we have acknowledged certain mistakes of ours. No, I'm not going to elaborate. No, but I can assure you. No, no, I'll tell you. I'll tell you. No, 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 no. It's not a question. Every time you say mistakes. Every time I'm saying mistakes because I'm asked the same question. What are the mistakes? What? There are many. We've made many, many mistakes. In, in, for example, I'll tell you. The Congress Party is, is an excellent party. The party might have erred when when selecting candidates. That is that is why this time we will ensure that we select candidates of character. Who are not good will come the other side. That, that is one mistake of us. In good faith, we gave him the ticket. These 10 people have come the other side. So, this is one of our mistakes. So, yeah. we will try and ensure that we do not repeat such mistakes of the past. Do you have any mechanism to stop people from going to the other side? See, as, as, to, 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 to the best of my knowledge, there is no such mechanism. So, what do you do? You select a person, you select a person in whom you have confidence, who you believe his character will not permit him to jump the other side, who will stand by the party, leave aside the party, who will stand by the side of his voter. His voter has voted him on, on, on a certain platform and he will not uh, let down the voter. You have not answered my question. I have answered your question. This no. is one mistake that I am highlighting, okay. that, we, that we have heard it. You may have heard in selecting the candidate. Hundred percent? Why not? But you have not answered my first question. Which is your first question? Why is this occasion there is a rise of the party to get people from outside so good to spend the time? 
See, which party doesn't want more people? You have failed to prove your leadership. Which party? You have failed to prove your candidates. Gilead, whether you have faith or you have not faith. Who doesn't want more people in his party? So that you make sure that we win in the next election. Even if there are others who have not come, please, I request them to come and join. Not for the sake of a ticket. To make sure that whoever the ticket given the ticket, you make him win. Now one more point, I just forgot when I am wishing our goals for the Chaturthi, I request them one thing. Please make sure that you follow normal songs. Because we have seen in Kerala, after the Onam festival, it is COVID increased by leaps and bounds. That we don't want to happen. Please enjoy yourself and see that you follow all these normal things we have been following. And that is the reason today the COVID-19 is very low in the state. Thank you. Uh, are you, uh, is it true yes. that the party has appointed you as a voting president? Is it a makeshift arrangement before you take over the reins of the party in the coming months? No, I definitely don't do it. As a Rogi, I have my limitations. And what within the setup? Is there any possibility of you being elevated to the post of the president in the coming months? No, I don't. वोकर <laughs> 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 <laughs>